Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Ratchet and Clank. When we last left off, we were making excellent progress. However, there are many enemies still in our way that we must clear. Let us do so, shall we? We do not have much in the way of ammunition remaining. This is a concern. What other ammunition types do we have available? Let's use the Glove of Doom here, shall we? It gave us a head start. Got to be said. And that finished the job. Exactly as planned, I would say, if I actually was not lying. One thing that could be as planned, though, is we could go back here and grab the health. No damage taken. There we are. There is some form of freighter thing here. We'll need to hop over on these platforms, which will probably fall. Nope. These are fine. These are stable platforms. Oh, there is a dude, though. The dude is gone. Don't have to worry about dude anymore. Let's switch back to the wallopum. Here comes another enemy. He is dealt with. We need not worry about this enemy any longer. Can I get on top of this? No, it seems not. Worth checking. Let's continue. Okay. The two rockets are certainly going to be useful. We'll grab those and be on our way. What's over here? This is a premium nanotech dispenser. You can purchase a can to increase your maximum health. Indeed I can. Let's do so. 4,000 bolts. This dispenser also carries Ultra Nanotech, the very latest in Gadgetron technology. Ultra Nanotech is three times more potent than Premium Nanotech. But we need 30,000 bolts for the Ultra Nanotech. We'll have to come back later for that. But we'll certainly take the extra health point for now. The ammunition won't go amiss either. The double Devastator rockets from that one helps a lot. So yes, one of you was already thinking I was saving up for something, and it was for this extra health. I misremembered how much health I would need exactly. It's interesting that in this one room, the air conditioning is actually working. We don't need our O2 mask. But, I suppose that makes sense, because we had to drink a product, right? If we had to do it through the O2 mask. That would not work. We have to re-enter uh, this area now. I don't want to take damage, thank you. So this is basically the same area we were before. That one area is like, oh, we don't need to clear. Turns out we're clearing it anyway. Because we're here. Yeah, we're pretty much almost done on this planet. We don't have the money to purchase the Ultra Nanotech just yet. The Premium Nanotech will be quite sufficient, however. There is one last thing that we can do. But the question is, should we do it now, or come back a bit later? Because here is what I'm talking about. You, can you see it? There is a gold bolt. There. To get there, however, we basically have to go around half the level. Now, uh, you can see it right there. Yeah, to get there, basically have to go all the way around. It's, it's not a short trek. So what we might do is come back to that one a little bit later. When, uh, when we have the money for the Ultra Nanotech. A little bit in the future. I think that makes sense. Let us now enter the ship. We have many places we can go. We have the planet Hoven that was been unlocked, which contains those uh, missiles that we need to go and acquire. As you can see, the bomb factory on Hoven. And I think we shall go to the bomb factory and destroy the planet buster. There are two gold bolts and a number of other optional objectives on Hoven. Let's go. Mm. 
one short flight, and here we are, the ice planet of Hoven. This planet does not appear in the remake. As you can see, it is very snowy. If we drop into the water, we shall instantly be killed and turn into an ice block. Let us avoid this ice block future. That must be the ship that will transport the bomb. You think? Great work, detective. Indeed. Oh, Ratchet's feeling a bit cold. He's uh, huddling, himself, huddling up of himself there. But there are many things that we can do here. Double tap the R1 button to activate hover, and hold the L2 or R2 button to stray from side to side. We could do that, but we're not going to. Strafing in this game is pretty awful. The Walloper, however, is excellent. Against this many blaster-wielding troopers, though, it's going to be a little bit rough. We have to use the ability to dodge our enemies instead of being shot by them. We got through it, though. I believe these are not, they cannot be destroyed. Let's grab the bolts, however. So we can basically head in this direction that we're heading now, or we could turn around and head in the other direction. Both are valid options. I think that I shall probably head into this small clearing and then turn around. This area here, for example. Let's destroy these uh, crates for some additional money. Excellent. Here are a large number of enemies. We must defeat these enemies. Without taking any damage. Why, you ask? We get skill points for this. But we must continue to be skillsome. Like so. We deserve a skill point for clearing all of these enemies without taking any damage. That is a skillsome display if I say so myself. There's also something else we can do. I remember this one from my childhood. We can bounce backwards and forwards using this floating platform to retrieve this gold bolt. Oh yes. That gold bolt is mine. Mine. And this ammunition is too. We need that ammunition. Let's continue. I'll gather the remaining bolts from my earlier carnage and continue. So we are now going to head in this direction over here. I suppose I should at least demonstrate this strafe, shall I? There we are. It's there. This is strafe. It's awful. <laughs> Let's not do that. Are there any new weapons we can purchase? They, there are. We have the drone device, which is a defensive power-up that you can use. It's relatively optional, but we'll go and get it later. But we're not going to be purchasing any more weapons until we have acquired that persuader. Let us head in this direction instead. Hello, enemies. How you doing? Rather well, it seems. All the bolts and ammunition are mine. As they should be. Let's progress. Oh. We have 15,000 bolts. It's a healthy amount of bolts to be having. Seems that there are some uh, touch points that we need to use. We'll need to be using the swing shot. Let's head over here. Slidey, slidey. Excellent. That opens the door. It does seem that there are some slidey shenanigans we can be doing. Let's use our metal detector, shall we? It's a small piecemeal amount of bolts, but it is certainly still money. And I shall accept this money. Alright. I think we're doing okay. Oh, there's a sun more up there, I believe. Come on, Ratchet. Fine. Swing shot. <laughs> and then metal detector. This is a this is an annoying set of bolts to grab, I've gotta be said. Oh, fine, we'll swing shot up. You can see why I have swing shot on the quick select, it's just necessary. Yep. 
We've done great on everything else this video, just not metal detecting, apparently. Come on. Let's have another more go, shall we, Ratchet? Up the hill. Got it. The next one's now over here. Of course, we've got to remember that this water is lethal water. It's not going to be helping us at all. Let's slide uncontrollably. Ah! Let's, let's check out Ratchet's face as he does this, eh? Oh, that's not really a big, good example. <laughs> let's just continue. Alright, a bit of wall jumping. Here we go. That's not a good start. Try again, girl. Uh, try again. The angle is an imperfect angle. There we are. <clears throat> I think I have to try this one again. It's such a disappointed noise when you fail it, isn't it? There we are. Progress has been made nonetheless. More free ammunition, which we shall certainly take. More slidey ice physics. Seems good. Fortunately, the swing shot shall help us out there. I wouldn't mind having this and this uh money though. Excellent. Oh, let's not slide into the ice, shall we? Whoa! Okay. Fly! One job, one job. Well, it put us here, which is fine, actually. I'll take it. I don't think we even need to do the beepy beepy puzzle to even open the laser fence. So we do. Oh, never mind. Let's try that again. Jump, Ratchet, jump! Oh. Hyper strike instead. There we are. Disappointed beeping stops. Alright, we're back. No one noticed. So, uh, we still even keep the money that we got. Time to do some more swing shot action, and we're gonna do it now. Timing is everything. Hello. Oh wow, you take two wrench hits. What a manly man you are. Alright, once again this water is lethal, let's not fall for any shenanigans. It's flame ammunition though. Useful on this difficult terrain. Excellent. Mechanics sorted them out just like so. And so far we're continuing to make progress. More ammunition. I appreciate not having to pay for it. Because paying for it is expensive. We could be saving for other things instead that actually matter. This however is a good moment for the taunter. I know, I've, I've done some reckless taunts in my life, but I think this is a, a decent taunter moment. Alright, well let's crouch jump. We actually get some movement in the air when we crouch jump. Hello. Did you notice me? I noticed you. I also fell off this ledge. At least I hyperstrike to make it a quick demise. Well, it even put us right back here. The game is being really generous of its checkpoints today, my goodness. I'm just demonstrating both expertise and failure in the one video, so it's very even-handed. Hello. Hello. Make your way over to me. Fine, I shall make my way over to you instead. Well, let's do that a little bit more properly. We've, we've, we've experienced falling to ice. I've demonstrated the ice death mechanics. We don't need to keep doing that. There we are. Let's grab all this money. And then make our way over to that laser fence. The ice physics. They're making me work for it. This one is going to involve some agility for sure. Alright. We now need to continue to move properly. Stretch jump. 
Got it. Hello. I am Ratchet. Oh, heck. Is there a problem, sir? Y'all wouldn't have any spare parts, would you? Help yourself. These dang rocks are too tough. I keep breaking my drill. That rock is raritanium. Let me look at that drill. Well, shoot my dog and call me Sally. Thanks, partner. No problem. I suppose I could take that rock off your hands, too. Heck, here you go. Look at that. We rocked his world. We fixed his drill and we got the Raritania. Which means we can head back to Pokitaru and grab ourselves a Persuader. The Persuader, of course, very important. Economic bonuses. Let us now fly! Or onto this platform, perhaps. That could be cool. Yes, yes we shall. Hello. Doesn't do anything, but I'm here. <laughs> Let us crack this box and call the video. Thank you all for watching. Let me come back next time. More Ratchet and Clank. More failure. More success. Maybe. <laughs>